Hi, and welcome to In the Game. I'm your host, Daniel Jackson, here to bring you the latest news on Cougar football and the recent red shirting of two of their players. University of Houston beat writer Joseph Duarte from the Houston Chronicle reported on Monday, September 23rd, that the Cougars quarterback De'Eric King planned a redshirt and set out the rest of the season to return in 2020. While at first details were unclear since this was a sudden announcement, there were initial rumors of King transferring rather than staying, but later that day, he and wide receiver Keith Corbin both put out statements on why they are redshirting this season. So instead of one player, two players are redshirting. Both wanting to focus on earning their degrees and reaffirming that they are staying at the University of Houston. On Tuesday, September 24th, Coach Holgerson and King held a press conference to provide further background on King's decision to redshirt, both stating that the decision was made after all options were put on the table after the loss to Tulane on September 19th, putting them at 1-3 for the season. King also addressed the rumors of him transferring and whether it'll be a possibility in the future. Here's what he said. Uh, I'm staying here. I'm here. Um, if I wanted to leave Houston, go somewhere else, I, I could have. Um, I think just me being here, uh, it's, it's what I want to do. I think it's the best opportunity for me. So uh, I don't think any, anybody will reach out to me, even if, if they do. Uh, they should know I'm staying here. As for my personal opinion on King Corbin's decisions to redshirt, it'll give them more time to learn and get even better under a new coach and offensive system. They'll still be involved with team practices and meetings, making a positive impact on the team, even without playing. As for who's taking King's starting spot for the rest of the season, Dana Holgerson announced that sophomore Clayton Toon will be the starting quarterback in the game against North Texas on Saturday, September 28th. Which I'm anxious to watch Clayton play. We've, we've, we've developed him over the course of the last nine months since I've been here. I think he's got you know, a ton of potential. Um, you, need, you need more than one quarterback on your team. How will our Cougars fare the rest of the season without Derek King? Keep up with In the Game to find out. Be sure to follow Coog TV on all social media and subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'm your host, Daniel Jackson, and thanks for tuning in.